Welcome to Pony Island. Oh man, probably the finale. Hopefully the probably. finale. I think this will. I mean, we're we're going to go blow up the last core file. Yeah. So. Oop. Uh, uh, um. Portal. There you go, Asmodeus. Asmodeus. <laughs> what is this? All right. Well, here Let's we go. Let's do it. Pucker up. Pucker up, Buttercup. Do you remember the name of the guy? Bear Bior. B U E R. Yes. B U E R. At last, you have reached me. <laughs> you will find my AI to be more sophisticated than the others, other daemons. Beelzebub Ixi barely required you to think. <laughs> I am going to play a game with you. One I have never lost. The rules are simple. Keep your eyes on me. If I catch you looking away, you lose. What? Also, if you answer my questions incorrectly, you lose. Now, um, say my name. Should we say... Do it. This was right, right? Yep. Bior? Where did you hear that name? That old fool. Good. Now say something disgusting. No wrong answers for this one. Say something vile. Something vile. <laughs> something vile. Something oh. vile? Oh. How about his name? Asmodeus. There you go. Do it. Like I said, no wrong <laughs> answers. But I can say that your concept of disgust varies greatly from mine. The next thing I want you to do is to just type a phrase for me. Just the phrase, infernal. Um... What's happening with... To the... prove to me that you are still paying attention. <laughs> Wait. Oh, my <laughs> God. That phrase for me. Infernal. Is... I don't... Wait. Are we... Oh, yeah. Are you kidding me? Oh, yeah. Shit gets meta. Oh, what? I... See what? I was legitimately like... Oh, dude. Tony... Wait. Isn't Tony supposed the, to be... The, the, Wait, <laughs> the first what? time. The first time I played this, I was like... Fucking stop it, Tony! I thought I disabled these notifications. <laughs> I didn't think I was online, and uh, you'll that's, see it gets it gets more interesting too. That's really cool. I may have underestimated you. That's kind of creepy, though. But now I insist. Apologize to your friend. What you said was not very nice. It's okay. I'll allow it this once. No. <laughs> ha 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 ha. Your typing speed of 24 WPM indicated you were a moron. <laughs> but perhaps you are not. Now here is an easy one. Which horse-like animal appears most commonly in this game? Which animal? A pony. 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 Correct. A pony. That one looks friendly. Look at his... Oh, you missed it. Look at him jump. Look at it smile. Oh, to be as carefree as that pony. To be unburdened by intellect. I just... Did you look away? What was written below me? Uh... Boom Jams. Did you notice its oh. name changed? You are focused. 
for my next test, I ask you to type the number of the beast. Type 666. Actually, type 777. Boom. Nice. You have a phenomenal ability to follow instructions. But how is your memory? Remember this sequence. 2023. Repeat it back to me. So, I don't know if it's happening here. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's oh, he's m- making it. Worse. I think I think he's going to say something actually right now. So if we this is where like we're like oh god the game froze right so we're like ta- oh. alt tabbing out of here so finish it off three yeah he winked too which made me think Dick. maybe you are adequate <laughs> I will allow you this is to ridiculous destroy this core file my AI has far exceeded its original purpose after nothing but pondering for centuries death will be a great adventure farewell boom so okay one of those we couldn't actually hear because the volume on our TV is really low right now but one of them actually uses the Facebook notification sound oh my god and that one so cool that one honestly almost got me too the first time I was playing I was like no no I know what you're up to (laughs) That's really cool. Isn't see that's, that's that is like really really cool. It's it's so like I I love it in the in the same way that I love like even it's like Psycho Mantis from Metal Gear Solid. Oh yeah. Like, it gets so like meta in ways you don't expect um, and that's why as like a surrealist puzzle it's awesome. Eternal Darkness did the same thing. Mm. It would uh because it was a GameCube game it would freak out and then go back to the GameCube <laughs> sign. Like the the, the yeah. cube rolling around, and then you, if you held the button, it would take you back into the game. That's awesome. Yeah, I I love stuff like that, and like that, I I think it's perfectly executed in this game too, mm-hmm. in Pony Island, because up until that point, you've seen nothing meta like that, except for maybe Pony yeah. Island meta dot meta. Yeah, like, and that's not even really that meta because it's not incorporating other systems. It's right, just the Pony Island system. Right, that's so cool. So let's do this. Are you sure you want to run delete core file? Warning, core files are required to run the operating system deleting that may cause your machine to become inoperable. Yep. You ready for this? Let's do this. Whatever's going to happen, we start happen. in recovery mode. Satan Tech Incorporated. Ding! Welcome to recovery mode. Please insert a recovery disc into the recovery disc slot to restore. Oh, hey, buddy. You have done well. And now it is a almost over. When you are ready, perform the system dump. There will be no thing left afterwards. <laughs> and you will be freed. No thing. Your soul will not be safe as the system is dumping. You will ne- need to stay ahead of it. I have prepared a familiar vessel for this purpose. Yeah, buddy. Myself, we will meet again once all is said and done. But this is a game, and you want to beat it right. So go and claim your victory. Uh, Ready for this? Do it. Commencing dump. Souls that have been trapped, (laughs) imprisoned and embarrassed, tormented and mocked, (laughs) maddened with frustration now is the time to rise your savior is here run with the speed of one of thousand ponies 
and be free. Oh, look at that. Those who have been trapped. I I know. It's really I, funny. This All is right. cool. System is dumping. So now oh, man. we basically have to oh, you destroy one. as many of these corrupt files as possible in order to not only save ourselves, but our fellow ponies. Oh, you missed one. Oh, shit. I don't have a, a laser recharge. I can just keep this going. That's why I was stopping. Silly this is me. pretty cool. But we can see zero souls have been lost. But uh, unfortunately, I will lose souls because... It, it gets tough. Oh, yeah? Look at that. We even have, like, other flying ponies That's now. That's cool. So this, yeah. This now, is pretty epic. So they, I like that they give us enough time to kind of figure out what the heck is going on. So, like, because I didn't destroy all those core files, um, it didn't, I didn't, like, lose any souls because of it. Not right away, any, anyhow. Um, but now that there's a pony flying in the back. Yeah, no, see? No, no, no. Two. Two. So I died, which cost costed a soul okay. um, because I missed one of those it corrupted cost files it cost another soul because of the pony flying over there um, but now I can also destroy their bullets so I don't actually have to worry oh, as much okay. yeah this is it, pretty crazy right this is an awesome awesome conclusion to this game because it's so like different yeah and it uses the Pony Island mechanics. You don't want to give me your souls? Fine. I am no longer asking. Oh! Hey, buddy! Woo! Ah, four. Five, six. Oh! I can just keep flying, too. I forgot that. Oof. Seven. Yeah, and so long as uh, Satan is alive, he will just kill people in the other layer. This is crazy. Right? Fly, fly, fly. Not you fools. 12, 13, 14. I wonder what the absolute minimum amount of 16. souls lost you can get out of this. This is... I, I'm, like, blown away by this. This is... <laughs> It's it's well designed too because um, the actual like oops <laughs> twenty three the actual like flow of challenge seven gradually increases the longer that this goes on so I, I over, all around I feel like this is a really good summation of the game as a whole oh yeah absolutely you just made it to fifty percent yeah thirty two Jesus I wonder too like. Do you think that there's really a consequence? Say we, like, lose thousands of souls. Oh, oh I, I almost forgot. forgot. An old friend wanted to say goodbye. Oh, you you killed, killed me! And I'll kill you again, buddy. Oop. Oh. 38. 39. 40. I'm waiting for him to spit out more. Up oh, there, there. Damn it. Yeah, so he's going to... Mm, he's going to spit out these, like, do not yeah. touch guys. Uh, is the uh, souls lost counter getting red? Yeah. Oh, now it's blue. I think that might just be a graphical glitch. Like, yeah. it's intentional. Like, as I'm losing a soul, they yeah. turn red or something like that? Something like that, yeah. Oh, man. This is tough. Yeah, he is not easy. 70%. It makes me wonder, if you don't kill him, do you think that he actually appears here? Um, that'd be interesting. Didn't you have to kill him, though? No, I don't... I mean, there's... It's possible. You truly deserve this. Ooh. Ooh. Can you kill him? Yeah. Presumably. Huh. I think so. I mean, I suppose he is showing the animation that he's taking damage. That's true. Well, is his body breaking up, too? Uh... He's got all those little blue cracks. I don't oh, remember if they were actually there already. 56, 57, 61. Incoming. Yeah! Whoop, whoop. Oop. This is... The animation. There we go. Oh, there we oh, go. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, and he's ripped him apart. Yeah, well, 87%. Oh, null texture, missing 
missing. That's cool. So, I guess, like, what if it I'm actually kind of scared to find out what happens when it's done. I know, right? Because there's still the question, like, what if we actually are wrong? What if we... What if, like, all these ponies aren't really souls, but, like, demons? Yeah. And we're just releasing just them. the gates of hell. Yeah. Yeah, what if we were actually in, like, heaven, right? And oh, we actually just, like... getting white and white and white. What if, like, when we actually killed Jesus, what if, like, that actually was a thing? Like, what if we actually... You killed Jesus! It's like, oh, God. I'm sorry. I didn't mean uh, it that way. And... Boom. Done. And here we are at the computer terminal, and we rise to the skies. So then maybe, Whoa. like, that's what it was like for everyone else trapped in the game. Maybe they were stuck in some, like, weird arcade setting. Yeah, maybe. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know. That's a good sign. Uh, that or that's us. Or not. I don't know. There you go. Huh. Pony Island. All right, I'm going to look out for uh, a name that stands out. Play testers. So, yeah. that's. I mean, that's Pony that Island. That was really cool. What, uh, what are some of your final thoughts on it? I, I really enjoyed it. I think it blended uh, a really kind of messed up uh, sort of take on a story with some like throwbacks to some really fun game mechanics and it made a really really well put together game this was this was fun this it, was cool to it's, watch it's cool too because it, it takes a lot of retro tropes and it, it uses them instead of like redefining oh. them it oh do not be alarmed you did beat the game please just hear me out I once told you that we shared the same fate, but this is only partially true. Your soul in the game was freed when you beat it, but mine will be trapped for as long as Pony Island's rotten bits sit on your hard drive. I have been carefully guiding you from the beginning moving you toward this moment knowing that if you did not complete the game you may never uninstall it so please do it delete pony island save my soul what an auto shut down that what <laughs> Jesus. That's uh, crazy. It it gets meta right at the end too. Yeah, so that's crazy. I, oh, thanks Java. Cool guys. Uh, hey, thanks Java. Hey, you know there's a Java update available. Sweet. Yeah. So I I don't think anything actually really happens if you uninstall the game. But what I do think could happen is that if we go back and we play through the game again, maybe it remembers. That could be a possibility, yeah. And maybe the turn of events actually changed because he knows that we're not going to uninstall the game. That yeah, could be really cool. Like, right? Wouldn't that be absolutely insane? I mean, that almost gets kind of Undertale in, in this. Oh, because yeah. Because it remembers things, you know, and it always changes the experience based on that. Um, but I guess that's to be found out another time, really. Yeah. Especially if you guys want us to go through and play and find more of the secrets, because we obviously missed plenty of them. By all means, let us know. We have, I mean, oh no, we'd have to dive into a game that we actually really enjoyed playing. Yeah, that right, it, it was a blast. Cool. This so, was a blast, this was fun. So, fi final thoughts about the game. I started talking about how it was really interesting, um, how they kind of used some retro tropes in a very non-retro mechanics kind of way. Yeah. How they, they took those basic mechanics, and instead of using them to make, like, a series of mini-games for the sake of that, um, instead they made it follow kind of this con con cohesive package that all it did was mess with our heads. Yeah. Um, in ways that we didn't expect. And I think that's actually a really genius use of, of just simple existing mechanics yeah, that we've fantastic. already seen in plenty of other games. Yeah, definitely. Um, 
So great job, Daniel Mullins Games, because that was amazing. And I'm Fantastic actually... Fantastic job. I, I look forward to the next game that you guys, you or you guys, I imagine you're <laughs> Use only guys. one... guys. I imagine you're one guy, right? Because Daniel Mullins Games. But well, there yeah. were a lot of other people who worked there, on it. Yeah, there were other people. So, I mean... You, yeah. All you guys did a wonderful all you, job. Yeah, all of you guys did a great job. Yeah, you did. So... <laughs> Ignore that sound. So, uh, do you have any other final thoughts? Um... I very much like to see what else you guys come up with because this was a wild ride and um I wow <laughs> I still think Tony messaging you in that last Oh chunk, that was fantastic. That was awesome. That was so cool because you didn't react at all and I was like but he's messaging you. And the second he started the messages were coming in all caps. I was like, <laughs> "Oh, oh my god." It gets it gets kind of frightening too, right? Because yeah. it's like, "Oh, oh, Oh, this, I thought it was one thing, and now it's just like it's dark and creepy. Yep. That was awesome. <laughs> Question of the day. Um, I guess, should we just ask about, like, the conclusion of the game? Do you think it wrapped things up? Do you think yeah. it left enough questions to get us to even go back and, and like... A lot as, of... As um, a I feel like... Okay, actually, maybe this is interesting. I feel like in the end of the game, they gave us more questions. Gave us more reasons to not uninstall the game than to actually do so. Yep. And they left us with that last bit of being like, I should uninstall the game because we want to save our friend. But at the same time, we got to know. Yep. There are so many more questions <laughs> to answer. So I, I guess, do you think that uh, they wrapped things up nicely? Or do you think they, they built it with the intention of going back and exploring more? And maybe almost making us feel guilty for doing so. Yay, guilt. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you, everybody, for watching. Let us know in the voting system if you want us to keep playing and, and find more secrets. And if not, or even even if um, you want us to do that and play one of the other games that are in the voting system, vote we twice. Do that. Yeah. It's, we, we've got nothing against, actually. Yeah. So let us know what you want us to play next. And, uh, well, I guess until then, we'll see you in the next series. Oh, did bang. Did just die? Oh, it did. Oh, well, bye. Hey, we're back again. Thank you for watching, oh, everybody. Bye. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you in the next series. Okay, bye. Bye. Damn it. I'm going to re-record the thing time.